football now and Thierry Henry will return to Arsenal on a two-month deal if insurance agreements can be worked out with his current club, the New York Red Bulls. He played for the Gunners for eight years before moving to Barcelona in 2007. This report now from Toby Sadler. From the day he signed in 1999 to the day he left eight years later, Thierry Henry was loved by Arsenal fans. He is their all-time record goal scorer. That's 226 in nearly 370 games. He's played at the Emirates just once since he left, for Barcelona, against Arsenal. But the fans still adored him. Their love was eventually cemented and cast in bronze outside the stadium. When Thierry Henry was voted Arsenal's best ever player and immortalised here in bronze at the Emirates earlier this month, he said, once a gooner, always a gooner. Arsene Wenger says he's not signing him for the body and the fitness he used to have, but for the footballing brain and attitude that he still does. To cover for two months is ideal and for the rest, uh, he has experience, he has quality, he knows the club, he can help the players on and off the pitch. He has a vast experience and uh, that's basically it. Timing is perfect as Arsenal are about to lose players to the Africa Cup of Nations and the fans are excited to see him back. I think it'll be a really great thing for the club. Um, it'll give the club a boost, especially when players are going away for the African Cup of Nations. And obviously he's a legend of the club and I think um, he'll do a really good job. Oh, well, it's, it's so famous, you know, it's unbelievable. Been unbelievable for the Arsenal. Legend. At 34, is he too old to come back and make a difference? No, if he's fit, he's been training with the lads. Uh, if uh, Arsene feels it's, it's right, he'll be right. Jerry's first game back could be against Leeds in the FA Cup third round on January the 9th, but he might also feature in seven Premier League matches and the Champions League during his two-month North London homecoming. Toby Sadler, London Tonight. But Gary Cahill's move to Chelsea.